It was voted in a recent poll that the number one most annoying thing right now in America, yeah. besides this show, mm. is oh. <laughs> dealing with customer service calls. Oh, yeah. my goodness. There yeah. is not enough human workers, so hold times are outrageous. Yes. And once you do finally get someone on, they're not actually qualified to help you. No. So yeah. we thought that's pretty bad. Yeah. But how do we make it even worse? Mm. So the first thing we did was make Jose a customer service. Agent. Okay. Yay, that's I a good can help. That I'm helps. Good step. Second thing, <laughs> even though he can speak English, yes, I can. He can't hear English. Ah, oh, I think see. about how frustrating yeah. that call would be, <laughs> and now hear it in your phone tap right now. Hello. Hi, this is Michael Smith from Apple Support. I'm looking for Troy, D- please. Oh, hey man, yeah, this is he. How you doing? Did did you say this is Troy? <laughs> yes, this is Troy. <laughs> um, okay, I'm going to take that as a yes. Um, you uh, sent us an email about an issue you were having with an iPad Pro M1, <laughs> uh, and I'm here to help you. <laughs> yeah, so the, the pretty much the problem I'm having is the Touch ID button is just not working on it. I've, I've tried resetting it. I've tried hey, pretty much I'm everything gonna, I've looked at. I'm going to stop you. Oh. <laughs> um is there a way you could say that in Spanish? Sorry. Another what? language? <laughs> sign language even? <laughs> Is it what? Well, I guess what, that what, wouldn't work. Say in Spanish? Do you know any other languages? Uh, Italian? Even Monsk? Do you know Monsk? <laughs> what are you talking about, brother? I'm just calling about my iPad. It's, I don't know any other languages. I, uh, I'm sorry. I can't understand you. <laughs> what do you mean you don't understand me? Is it a phone issue or is my, you don't understand my iPad problem? Uh, not sure what you're saying. Oh. Not sure what I'm saying about what? I don't hear English. <laughs> We're having a full conversation in English. You don't, what do you mean you don't hear English? Yeah, again, didn't catch that. Uh, but here's my situation. Look, I do speak English. I just don't hear it. Well, at least right now. In this little situation I'm dealing with. What? I'm sorry, what? What was that? <laughs> this doesn't make sense. You're speaking English perfectly. Okay, again, not really sure what you just said, but what? back to me, wasn't always like this. I was at a Renaissance fair last month, got hit in the head with a rogue cabbage, oh. completely zapped my ability to hear English. <laughs> Doctors, totally stumped. No idea what's going on with me. Wait, so uh, let me get this straight. Your, your entire job is predicated on you talking to people on the phone and you... I, this doesn't make any sense. You're speaking to me in English. I don't, I'm assuming what whatever you just said, you're giving me, like, sympathy for what happened. Oh. Right? I, I, I do appreciate that compassion. I'm just a normal guy who got hit in the head with the cabbage. How are you supposed to help me if you can't understand me? I, I'm calling about a... You called me. Okay. Um, just going off of the tone of your voice, it sounds like your problem's fixed. Wait, no, 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 no. What? No, my, my problem isn't fixed. You haven't done anything to help okay. me. Okay. Mm-hmm. Again, can't hear English, only speak it. Not sure how many times I could say that. What? Uh, why are we on the phone? Can I talk to somebody else? Like, what's no, this? thank you. You're welcome. No, that's not what I said. So before we get off the phone, uh, how would you rate my customer service skills today? One to five stars. Hit Zero. the button. Don't speak it because I can't hear it. Yeah. Zero stars. <laughs> Nothing was fixed. Wow. Was that five stars? I'm going to no, no, put it no. down. You are generous. Oh, my Zero. goodness. Talk about turning a bad situation into a positive. Oh. This is amazing. Zero. <laughs> hey, by the way, you're warned on your eyes iPad expires tomorrow, so good luck with that, huh? What? Glad you got this done in time. <laughs> that was sucked. No, transfer me to a f- manager right now, dude. I'm sorry, I can't transfer you to a manager. Transfer me to a manager. No, what I the can't. F- no, not what the. F- don't swear at me. <laughs> Wait, what? You, you heard that? Oh my god, I'm cured. Uh-oh. It's a miracle. <laughs> Or a prank phone call. You choose. Wait, what's good? What are you? A prank phone call? What? <laughs> this is actually Jose from the radio show Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning, man. We're doing a prank on you. This is what? a phone tap. <laughs> Yo, are you shitting me right now? <laughs> <laughs> Bro, your girlfriend Ada set you up. She said you're having a bunch of problems with your iPad and you're like <laughs> super dreading that customer service phone call later. <laughs> I am having a bunch of problems with my iPad.
iPad. That, it was very frustrating. <laughs> Aren't you glad I can hear you now? Oh. Yeah, I, it's great to feel like I'm talking to a Troy, human Troy, Troy, I said, aren't you glad that I can hear you now? <laughs> yeah. It's, <laughs> what are, no, I need, no, I need you to speak another language. You know, Swahilin or, oh, monks. Do you want to go back to monks? Oh. That's a good language. I can speak fluent monks. <laughs> Okay, I get it. Joke's over now. Yeah, joke's over now if you didn't hear it. <laughs>